morning, good morning. Today is uh, another work day in my life. Last day of, yeah, the last couple of days I worked has been hectic and busy. But what do you expect for January? But we are in February now, so we'll see if that changes the busyness. Probably not because ER winter time, COVID, flu, RSV. That would be busy. So, but the difference now is, for well, the last couple of days, I have another new grade with me. Why they keep giving me students, I have no idea. Mystery to me. But today I will have that same new grade again. Hopefully, she doesn't think I am completely incompetent. Um, yeah. Let's, let's hope I teach her well. Let's hope that, you know, I didn't get my head because honestly, she is going to be, I say this, honestly, I say this about like every new girl I'm oriented, or have, yeah, have oriented, but they keep giving me people who are like super, super smart people who like know what the heck they're doing and I'm like why are y'all giving me people with tremendous amount of potential? <laughs> I think she should be with a preceptor who's matching your potential. Anyways, so yeah. Um, she's super, super smart. She has a whole heck of a lot of initiative. She has a sense of agency and she's very proactive with things and so I'm like why is she with me? I don't know, but hopefully I'm going to teach her well today. Hopefully it's not too chaotic today also, but you know, we'll see as the honest. Well, I will update y'all probably after I get off work because HIPAA and privacy laws. So, so shift went very successful. I my new grad did really well. Very, very, very proud of her. She handles four patients pretty much on her own. Flipped a couple of her rooms until up until the very end. And it got a little, little hectic because we I on the trauma and critical care team. So all the traumas, all the strokes, all the stimmies, all the things we went to on top of taking care of our patients. So, did really well. She did very, very well. She does need to work on speed of the ER patients, but that will come with that. But she's already a whole lot faster than I am. And, yeah. Didn't think anyone could move faster than me, but it is possible, apparently. So, and she can stick really well. And, her time management, her communication, her prioritization is amazing. So, why, once again, why she got put with me, I have no idea. But here we are. Here we are. And this is only in the week two for her. So, in, yeah, week, in the week two, and she has 10 weeks total. So, let's get it. She's going to be really, really good. Why she got put with me? Again, I do not know, but yeah. and um, what else? All oh, the brain, brain bleeds. Everybody having a stroke, stroke of cardiac arrest, and no, most of it is from COVID. I thought this was over. Lots of like brain bleeds and strokes and cardiac arrest from COVID or like they had COVID and now they had having strokes and heart attacks from it. I'm like, but not the fun heart attack where it's the stimmy but you can cast that really, really quickly. It's like the bad one where it's like you got your chest compressions for like forever and then like, you know, all those resources. And then they don't, they don't, you don't get back. So yeah, not the good heart attack. Those are the bad ones that takes a whole bunch of time and resources. <laughs> so. Yeah, but I'm off this weekend. They're already asking if I can come into work this weekend. 
but one of my friends who is from out of town, we in the same place this weekend, so I may do something with her and her boyfriend this weekend and a couple other people. We'll see. Also, you'll get a vlog, you'll get another vlog tomorrow, so you'll see what occurs tomorrow. But as I'm trying to decide what I'm doing with that, so you'll get a full vlog tomorrow. I'm going to finish listening to Taylor Swift Red Taylor Vision because quality. So shower, eat. Watch YouTube, read, journal, bed. I like that. That's a good. I feel like a good way. So, I showered, ate, watched YouTube. In my gratitude journaling and red and now it's time for me to go to sleep because I am tired after the day <laughs> so exhausted from all the crazy rest, strokes, brain bleeds, intubations, all of the things, traumas, everything so it's a good day though I'm tired, I'm gonna go to bed if you liked the video give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and I will talk to y'all tomorrow and y'all have a good night. Good morning. Well, good afternoon. Good, day, uh, good morning, good afternoon. It's brunch time. Today is my um, day off. And so I am treating myself to a little solo day of just me time. So I'm taking myself out to brunch right now. I'm waiting for my food. I'm outside because it's nice outside. It's sunny and it's clear and blue skies and sunshine, so it's my aesthetic in my life. And so, many things for me, so this is what those things doing for me. So, away from my food. And then, I'm just gonna like do what feels right today. I may go to a coffee shop later and just read and edit. I do need to actually go like. So, coincidentally, there's a couple of new students who apparently want me to teach them, so I'm going to do that also. So, I'll film my own vlog up because, you know, Shannon came up this week, it's not fun. But, hey, it's just going to be all about me because, yeah, I will talk to y'all later on the day, but I want to update something this morning because it's been a minute since I've updated since I went to sleep so yeah day to me day a solo day for me because I can <laughs> I don't have to answer this to anybody which is lovely so yeah I'm gonna go eat my food but I will obviously I'll, I'll show it to you before I eat it because you know that type of person <laughs> I'll talk to you a little bit. Good morning. So um, I kind of didn't end the vlog yesterday. After my coffee shop adventures, I went to church. And then we did the young girl group stuff. And basically the young girl stuff for us that was we watched the movie Groundhog Day and then got basically lectured every 15 minutes about it. <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, it was an entertaining movie, I guess. Yeah, I mean, it was entertaining. It's, I'm, I'm gonna sum it up this way. It's a rom-com for dudes. That's the best way I can to explain that movie. It is a rom-com for dudes. Cause I was just like... The dude, the, the main character's a dude. He is a jerk in that movie. He is an absolute jerk. And I'm just like... He is 
just literally no update will for David will call on this until like ten minutes like the last ten minutes of the movie. And when he finally learns how terrible he's being to the people around him, even to the girl he's trying to have sex with. Which I mean <laughs> also, and honestly that's pretty much the gist of the movie is him doing all these things to get laid. And I'm like, okay. This is okay. Okay. We watching this? Okay. Whatever y'all want to do. Whatever y'all want to do. But, um, today's, I'm just going to do like a, a week in my life because yesterday and today is kind of a continuation of my little solo days, day, um, with the exception that my charges before I left work. Somebody you come in Sunday? We're gonna show it. Ready you come in Sunday? Ready you come in Sunday? Ready you come in Sunday? I'm like, I'll think about it, I'll think about it. So then I was like, this morning I was like, you know what? I said to my, you know, journaling and all that stuff, I was like, you know what? I'll go in from one to seven after church. So I'm on I'm on my way to church. Just letting you know I'm not driving, I'm I'm, I'm parked, just letting you know. So, um but I'm gonna go to church and then I'm gonna go to work after well, go to church, get food. Then go to work after. Yeah. So, this is my church fit for today. Church is over, but it's my winter church fit. And I'm about to go from church appropriate to nurse because I'm about to go to work in about an hour so while well, I look nice and adult and professional also I really like these shoes I really like these shoes I really like this outfit such a nice outfit so I'm gonna change clothes and subscribe and then I will talk to y'all and we are in work attire now scrubs and my sweatshirt because and these are not my work shoes. These are just to get me in the car to change into when I get to work. So, gonna go socialize a little bit before I go to work. So, um, I think the last thing you saw was me changing clothes at church to go to work. And I haven't had to edit update since because it's the next day. And, um, yeah, so I didn't update. So, this is gonna be the wrap up update because I was tired. Flash did a bunch of stuff after work, but didn't pull my camera out, so yeah. Um, basically, when I got to work, I floated, tasked, and resourced it with everything. My, really, the first thing I did when I first got to work was help with an EBD going to uh, Crady, and so it was me. Respiratory and others taking the patient, the EBD, the monitor, and a vent over to the interventional radiologist point so they can do the credit procedure. So that's how the day started. And then everyone was having hemorrhagic strokes, every single person, cardiac arrest everywhere. And I'm just like, well, why is everyone so sick? I don't know. But it was, I enjoyed it because I literally got to go and task and do all the things for everybody, which I enjoy doing because it keeps my attention and I don't have to like, I hate holding patients, I don't mind holding patients, like I'm not taking care of them, but like I would prefer just to like do stuff and then have them go somewhere else. So that's basically what I did. And then I would Get, make sure patients were upstairs, help, basically help with three but also. So I did all of the things, all of the things. So yeah. And then we were, we were smooth still for the most part. I mean, we were getting sick patients, but they were, you know, coming sporadically. But then literally 15 minutes before shift change, two cardiac arrests. Two cardiac arrests. So day shift was in one, night shift came out and helped the other one, and yeah. Two, two cardiac arrests. What? 
Insane. 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 And then after work, I went to go eat dinner out with two of my church friends. And so that was, that took up the rest of my night because, yeah, yeah. Well, to like nine. And I don't probably came out because they don't like gamers and all that stuff, so yeah, I didn't do that. Um, so did that. We had a, had a nice, nice conversation. So for now, it was a very, very quality conversation. We had a bunch of different things. So yeah, that was very good. Very much enjoyed that. Um, we got home and just literally showered did my five minute journal and went to bed because yeah so I'm wrapping the vlog up now we will start a new vlog for today but yeah I forgot to end the vlog so I'm still doing it now um that was like it was supposed to just be like a good like weekend off of my life days of my life but it was I, I feel like it was a good combination of like Solo self care day off with a little sprinkle of what it's like to be in the orders. So if you like that video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe button, and I will talk to y'all in the next video. So.